I think it might be a dead guy I can talk to over here. Actually, I could probably talk to some of those dead guys as well. Why did I think of that? Oh boy. There's a dead true soul here with a candle. I guess that didn't work for him. Yeah, well. <laughs> I'm just going to talk to him. The corpse regards you lifelessly. Uh, what do we actually want to know from this guy? How'd you end up here? Yeah. Definitely, that didn't work out too well for you. Mm. Unslaked hunger. Oh. Unquenched thirst. It's a dickish way to go. Hmm. Unless it's a metaphor for all the horrible things that's going around. Spell. Continual flame. Hey, that's smart. Why would I want to extinguish no. the torch flames? Not sure, yeah. I don't know, now asking general questions till we run out. Mm. True soul of the absolute, call is my name. Wait, so the absolute can't move around here freely, so they're, they are truly... Okay. The spell's power wanes. Whoever cursed this area questions. doesn't like him either. Or doesn't like this particular geographic location. So let's be honest, oh. seems a little. Well, there's a chest over here. I'm oh. trying to get ambushed. Oh, yep. There they are. You just got ambushed, didn't you? No. I, I can see them just behind these, um. Things in front of me. Building. Like directly. Whereabouts are you? Are you near me? Yeah, just behind you. Yeah, directly in front of me in that building is. Oh, where yeah. All... Yeah. Ah, uh, the measles, yeah. Nazi little fucks. There's a chest over there that I was heading to. Hmm. Oh, these things, anyway. Uh, oh, fuck, they got a fair bit of health. Yeah, ugly little fuckers. This is where the game started getting a bit harder. Dark vision, opportunity attacks. No, so that's not true. The dexterity is decent, but everything else is pretty average. Yeah. Alright, what do you reckon? Well, the gods on them out? Uh, I mean, we could. Get my level 4 spell slot back. Let's see if I can get. It's the easiest way to get in there. Suppose I'll just go down towards the stairs. Yeah. Good try Take to see. Take them off, I guess. That might be worth a look. Softer than a whisper. I don't know what she spotted, but she spotted something. Hmm. I think it's a brick. Oh, yeah, yeah it is. She spotted a movable brick. Alright, I'll just freaking run down the guts with these three and I guess create a ruckus. Well, I could hit two of them now or possibly three if I could move a little bit further forward. Yeah, well, I'm fine here. Go three if you want. Just smack them. Up to you. It's a shame that most... like it sucked. It's a real shame that most of that was actually against, you know... In static objects. You should also be careful of the ice. <coughs> ah, I forgot about that. Oh well, fuck it. Mm. Well, I mean, they're surprised, so it's less, less than an issue. Uh. Hmm. Oh, fuck's sake. God damn it, I hate it when that happens. Camera moved and you walked around it? Yeah. Yep. God damn it. Such bad rolls.
is too dark. I <laughs> sucked in. Worth it. One of the reasons I love Ice Storm. Jesus, that thing just does not want to die. If you can, if you've got any other attacks, because I could probably finish um, that guy off with. I oh, know he's next in line. Yeah. That? Yeah, that works. I was actually going to say I could finish him off with Keely, but yeah, she's a bit too far down the turn order. Ooh, saved. Aren't you clever? You can see why I like Carlac. Yeah, no, I always did. Like, mm. think she was going to be fucking awesome, but it was more of a... She just doesn't fit our particular breakup of party we have at the moment. Hmm. Which is a bit shit. I mean, if I wasn't a paladin, then we could definitely bring her to Shatterheart, but... Yeah. I'm a paladin. But if we if we do um, play through two, you should definitely be romancing Carlac. Tempting. Because she... She's easily the most fun character in the game, I think. I'll see how much I like the uh, Shadow Heart romance. Hmm. Well, well, we'll have seen that by then. Yeah, but I'll see how much I like it. Maybe I want to repeat it. <laughs> uh. I mean, I'm kind of liking the Paladin build at this stage. It's actually doing stupidly well. No, there is one. No. Oh, right. I thought I'd end my turn. Well, that's rude. Seriously. God, they just want to, like, you know sit there and go, I have infinite health or some shit, Jesus. The, fuck, the fuckers actually want to leave, which seems very rude. I forget. I'm gonna go and open that brick. Oh, you, you gotta get up that chest up there, it's locked. Oh, yeah. Uh, at the entrance. Oh, there, it's not locked now, because that's a, this little loose brick had the key for it. Alright, well, you can go and unlock it, I suppose. Uh. Okay. Ooh, that's nice. Send you a pair uh, of send you a pair of gloves. Uh, what are they? And the word deals radiant damage. Ooh, hello. Essentially, I if replaced you... my dexterity gloves. Hmm. -mm. If you if you deal radiant damage, you do you apply the light thing to them, which makes them hard easier to hit for everyone else. Or is yeah. it a deep or is it deep up for them hitting? I can't remember. Uh, um, minus one for the remaining turn, mm. and it's bright light to the area around them. Wait, slow night resistance. Just send you a note about it. Also, also a um, statue of some woman or other. Other statue. Oh, it's two. Yeah, one of those before? This is, yeah, there was one we found before in Shadow Heart. That was Sharp, wasn't it? No. It's actually a slow night, really, at the start, where she said, why are you picking up that, you know, personal oh, stuff? It's probably one a trinket, it's okay. useless. Yeah, I kept it, because... Weirdly, I gave it to Shadow Heart, and her affection went up. Yeah. I was like, okay, something's going on here, I'll just keep this, just in case. Uh, did also just pick up some new clothes. Oh, like, bargain, please. I, I say new, they're a bit meh, or whatever, but... As I recall, oh. they look a bit ratty, but also sort of cool before it. Dusty Grey, well, they've got to be better than my current. They have that sort of numb, beaten, but I've cool I've been on look. the road look, yeah. yeah. Yep, I've been on the road look. Hmm. 
Alright, cool. Uh, I'm gonna stay where are we? Of, I'm gonna stay the lots of dexterity for a minute. Yeah, go for it. Well, actually, you could probably use them for picking locks and stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm mostly wondering what difference it would make to armor class. Uh, you are probably uh, guaranteed to get the plus two bonus. No, I actually go down to go down by one. And your gloves. Oh, you had gloves of armor, didn't you? Braces, braces of defense. Yeah. Uh, what the hell was that? You're moving out of uh, out of uh, safe zone by the look of it. Ow! Because you don't Gosh, have light, light on, on myself again. No. Weird. I think it's a concentration spell, isn't it? I believe so. I can't remember. What did you spot this time? Uh, a trap. Easy. What's in there then? If there's a trap there. Uh, chains and a chair. Something that's definitely chairs. not creepy. Uh, stay still, fucking camera. Ah, plus one bonus to armor class while obscured. Not bad, I suppose. Try right for a save. Hmm. Uh, this is into a heavier area that we kind of need help with. Heavy area? As in, like, there's two areas of shadow. This one where it's, debil where it's debilitating, and that one where you take damage. Oh, so and, and where light, that way. Yeah, and where light, regular light does not help. Ah, uh, yep. Don't think the blood of the hand is like does either. Uh, well, we'll get to the other bit and then yeah. probably have to disappear because. Hey, what? Working shit. Oh, one of those measles is actually unconscious rather than dead. How did I just find another drow hood? Oh right, I, I dragged I dragged the uh, braces into my inventory. It probably um, was on top of another item, another item, and it was just that. Oh, right, okay. I'm like, where did that come from? That makes a small amount of sense. I do not have the torch yet, because I'm a moron. Thank you. I, want to have a word. I gave you a torch, didn't I? Yeah, I'm... Okay, that's better. For some reason, I didn't want to be equipped. It might have been when we were in the fight. Yeah. That, no, that's just going north again. Well, we do need to go and north. We can, oh, okay, that that well, is basically the right path. That way. Yeah. This place is seriously fucked up. Yeah, it is a bit. Been some rather over the top cursage going on here. Mm. As you know, it raises my age old question of why? Oh. What were they trying to achieve? Yeah, if, you, if you zoom all the way in and look to your um, northwest. That's yeah. uh, that's where we're heading. You may notice a, an interesting looking uh, building. Ah, oh, yep, seen. No, if it's interesting, it's just looks like, and that sort of thing. Well, it's got a giant fucking globe of light around it. Uh. Oh, it does too. Yeah. I was looking at it too close. Right. Yeah, it's kind of, it's weird how it's easy to miss. Just checking down here because we haven't exactly explored this bit yet. This is a bit where I shouldn't go. The curse has torn open the ground itself. Uh, okay. That's curse more, has more torn or less, open the ground itself. Yeah, that's more or less back where way we came. Alright, let's not go down there then. Because it's just near the teleport point we found. Or waypoint or whatever the fuck they call. Ah, yep. It's true. Let's go over here. Ah, fucking camera. Oh. What did you miss? Failed I don't perception. Know. Perception failed. Maybe another ambush. 
Oh, it is another ambush. We should not be in this place yet. Because if you look up there. Oh, yep. Seen. And it's, it's not alone, let's just say. Dead Harper and everything up there as well. No. Yeah. Let, let, let's head to that interesting building instead. Um, okay, so that's. That way, I suppose. Basically, northwest, yeah. I really hope that you get this conversation. In fact, I'm saving it just on the off chance. Ah. So I guess. Oh, over the bridge. Here we go. Yep. This place is protected. You might find allies here, or at least supplies. Oh, uh, Harper. You there! Oh. Step forward oh, and keep your hands off your weapons. Easy. She helped us out in the shadows. Come. Let's look at the amount of blood on me and I'm uninjured. I am badass. Mm -hmm. Jahira! Wait. Hello. Fuck old. off. Hello, old friend. I'll be damned. shit she hasn't changed pretty much no ha. well I am certainly no innocent paladin so I'll bind you with vines a moment longer if you do not mind holy cross she really hasn't changed this is why we're here you see it is a curious creature that hides all manner of secrets. But if there's one thing that we know... She's gotten old, but Jesus. It has been a century. It its own kind. You yes. should never have come here, true soul. The fuck? A bit, yeah. Well, um, I yeah. can't want to break out of the vines just because, yeah. but I, I please don't piss her off. Yeah, I'm also like one of the greatest wow. heroes of the Sword Coast. Please don't piss her off. Wow, I, huh. Who protected the Emerald Grove? Yeah, it's small. Didn't leave a goblin standing. Not so bad to hang around with either. Save two of my friends one from a harpy and one from a mad druid with a snake. Didn't make a fuss of our thieving either. <laughs> I pretty much trust her with my life. A true soul with a mind of her own? How is that possible? I'm I'm still weirded out. Um, yeah, I want to show the artifact. Did you hear it? I mean, like, yeah, yeah. Wow. Huh? What in the hell is that thing? Oh, oh. Um okay, yeah, I'm telling her stuff. You've earned yourself the benefit of the doubt. What the fuck? Hear me Harpers, all clear, at ease. I'll not pretend to understand what that artifact is. But I'm old and wise enough to recognize a sliver of hope when it crawls out of the dark. Tell me, why have you come here? What the fuck? Um...
Well, I'm kind of here to destroy it. Also That's for QR. Also for QR. And in a sense, it's kind of a holiday, but it's more of a working holiday. Well, I suppose it's number two. Uh, it's number one at best. Yeah, it's going to number two. Then our interests align. We must all cure ourselves of the entire cult of the absolute. There's food in the inn over there. Beds too, if you require rest. Elo oil in the cupboard, in case the vines gave you a rash. Settle in. Then come join me for a drink. You may just be the godsend we've been praying for. Wow. That's um... I did not expect that. Um, you may want to talk to Kalak. I really did not expect that. Um, hi Kalak. Oh my god, soldier. That's Jahira. Yeah, no shit. Jahira. I know, right? Like, what the fuck? Wow. Option number one is just glorious. <laughs> Don't you know the whole story? Years ago, over a century, Jahira was part of a group that saved Baldur's Gate from Saravok, a ball sport trying to plunge the city into war. My mum used to tell us stories about them. The legends who protected the city from evil. She said Jahira was a powerful druid. Adamant. Tough. I've told myself those stories a thousand times since. I never thought I'd meet Jahira. She's a hero, and I was always... some outer city kid. Can't believe she wants to talk to us about working together. What a day! <laughs> Proper fucking fair girl moment. Yep. <laughs> That's the reason we need Kalak. Also because, you know, there's, there's a blacksmith over here that may be able to help. I wish we had that was that's that's well done like hats mm -hmm. off larry that's give give, that's well a, give the backstory and give the backstory in the way that you know fans would definitely appreciate yeah that's um quarter mystery is there that's depending on whether you want to do um selling stuff now or next time uh, i figured i'll have a look and then probably back off depending on what sort of stuff she has stock up while you can i only I mean, i've got a lot to, to sell you. so Jesus Christ, when was the last time we talked to her? Yeah, there's a decent chunk of stuff. I'm not actually sure you've done it. Oh, we've got some infernal metal, there we go. Yes! We need to go find Damon. I'm going to get a hug soon! <laughs> Wait, Damon? The blacksmith bloke. Didn't we already do that? Yeah, but he had some more ideas. That's why you needed more metal. Okay, um... I'm just happy to know someone can do something about this little situation. You calm down quick. I was alone, but I'm not, am I? With your help and Danon's, I might be able to get a little more control over this. I think I need a shower. None too soon either. You got a uh, bottle of water you. handy? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure I can find something. Then I'll shut a house, gonna have to, you know, magic some water and shower me. Oh, yeah. actually, wait. I'm, th I'm thinking that's probably a waste of a spell slot. Or she's in the shower with me. I do need a long rest, I say. You could do it then. But look at me. <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying, I I could do with a long rest because I'm very low on spell slots. What Fine. About it? I had to let off a little steam after facing off with those ignots. Granted, the fire lasted a little longer than it should. Um. Engine heats up the whole system enough not to get burned. Hopefully no. we'll hold together long enough. I'm to romancing Shadow Heart because she's Let's Shadow Heart. I'm running high and in the mood for a fight. Yeah, but you know, Carlax Carlax. So. I know Carlax Carlax, but Shadow Heart, Shadow Heart. Mm. Shadow Heart wins. He's romancing the Gith. The Gith Dominatrix. It's a bit weird. You say that. Yeah, I was the one who had to watch that. It was a bit weird. No, you're, you're entirely allowed to not watch cutscenes. Yeah, I tried, but it's like watching a car crash. You want to see what misery unfolds. Demons, on the other hand, every demon is Apparently, it was quite good, so. Crazy dominatrix thought you did old, so, yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Works for me. Anyway, what we talking about? Uh, yeah, I really haven't talked to her a lot. 
Jeez. Um, well, we haven't really been using her in the party, so. Once my engine's handled, I can focus on more important. Well, it'll be easier if we do replay number two and use her and. Did we say we're going to use her and fucking. Miss Tarion, I think. Yeah, Stabby Boy. Yeah. Yep. And I think, yeah, the, the third playthrough, if we go that far, will have to be the two mages. Fuck, let's make an all mage party. That could be interesting, actually. Just for the shits and games. A, a sorcerer, a mage, a warlock. Ten what else would he have? Yeah, one what, of each. Cleric, maybe? Sleepy little town oh, but then we'd have to use Shadow. Nah, uh. Our hero, bard. Not yeah? From the outer yep, city. Bard. With everything to give and nothing to lose. That would be fucking hilarious. Way to fill my days and make some cash when I fell into the wrong crowd. Worked for a guy I respected. A lot. Turns out the feeling wasn't mutual. Through the jigs and the reels, he made a deal with Zariel behind my back. You know Zariel, right? Archdevil of Avernus. She put this thing in my chest and set me to work. Well, to war. I learned quick how to stay alive. And the engine served me when it came to killing devils. Ten years of that. The stories I could tell. I just wonder why Zariel chose her. Because she's awesome. Yeah, before she had the... Bit by bit, so you always have a reason to keep me around. Clever, right? So she must have been utterly psychotic beforehand as well. What's on your mind? Zora, we yep. We both part of Zariel's inner circle. Her by choice, me by force. In the grand scheme of things, I'm inconsequential to Zariel. Sure, I've got the engine, but I wasn't even her strongest fighter. She favored me like a child favors a captive pet. Mazora envied the attention, I suppose. I'm sure when Zariel gave her the order to hunt me down, Mazora was delighted. I don't know. You'd think she'd have more important things to do. Devils and their pride. <sighs> no kidding. The fighting, the chaos, the betrayal. It had the makings of a good stage show, but I did not want to be one of the players. Right, what have we got? Oh, we haven't got many left. Awesome. It wasn't all that long ago. I, never I have asked her this before. Why, Jesus, sorry. I remember yeah. the devil mm. slavering with delight. Gives me energy. Power. Two. But you've seen it in action. Uh, one. It's got to be one. Yeah. I try not to think about it. Yeah, see, I remember that. <laughs> that's just weird. That, that's what makes romancing so good. She meant to do something else? Because uh, I've only got those two left. I'm guessing you don't have to talk to her at an advanced that stage of the quest. You probably just have to talk to Damon. Who's just... Oh, is... Over that away. Off north. Uh, north. That's not north, that's north. Damon, Damon, Damon. There's a looking thing. Only you should be in here somewhere, right? Her? Sight. It is a strange ox. He's injured. Why is he injured? Strange ox. That's odd. Not strange, to be precise. Um, do I have a talk to things thing? I was just thinking, seeing if we've got to talk to animals. Yeah, what do they look like again? Because... Uh, you've got oh, four, four of the yeah. potion of animal speaking. Like a green tapered bottle with a deer head on top, I think it is. Yeah, found it. No incapable. Hey. Okay. Yeah, he was from the Jewel's Grove. Mm. Not for you to know. Alright, yeah. well, I guess I gotta persuade and that's it. Persuasion's your best bet. You'd probably still say no, but. And give it a shot. 
Come on, come on. Oh, yes! Yeah. Natural success, didn't even need the bonuses. Okay. Well... Come close. Your mind to mine. Oh, that's a falcon. Am I over the... Ow? What the... F what? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, he's not a falcon, he's a reaper. What the fuck? Yes, he's a reaper. Just need the chest. That's a bit... He's not a cow. <laughs> I got a hunch that maybe he's not. Um... Keep quiet, and you won't have to find out. Um... Uh... Yeah, is that a threat? Like, that's Nothing the thing. To you. Okay, that's... When we are hmm. not we are not killing the ox, I want to see where this goes. No, uh, I'm just a bit curious. Yes, yeah, me too. That's why I want to keep it going. Because <laughs> this is this has already been one of the stranger parts that I'm I actually missed that in um, playthrough too, or my first playthrough rather. That's just weird. But Darren's just in. So weird. Sorry, I'm looking in the sack, seeing if there's anything to see. Nah. Fair enough. I was speaking to my brother last night, and he's like, check everything. I'm like, why? He's like, I found something in a stupid place. I'm like, oh, what? I'm not going to tell you, but check everything. Fuck. Oh, yeah. So you apparently there's something insane. in a really dumb place. You find insane things all over the place. Hi, Damon. Why am I getting pulled into these? Wait. Karlak, I thought he's dressed significantly fight. better. We were ambushed by cultists. Half of us were captured, the other half ran here. Off the anvil into the forge. He is dressed better, I'll isn't he? About the same, I think. Before you run off into sure. the... Well, two things. Good news and bad news. Okay. Um, Karlak, up to you. The good news, obviously. Oh, I don't yeah. need one more piece of infernal iron to craft an insulating chamber that can make it possible for Karlik to... Touch people! Exactly! Oh my god. It's really happening. Well, I've got two bits, so what it's else can she do? So Wait, don't long. ask that question. <laughs> We've got the iron. Let's do this thing! Hang on! I think you'll want to hear the bad news too. Yeah, sure. But first, fix me. Please. I, uh, fine. Got a, yeah, I'm not an ass. Fine. Well, go on then. I don't Damn enjoy it. saying this, Karlak, but there's no two ways about it. Your engine is going to blow, and I can't fix it. What? I'm not sure anyone can. It's simply too hot to exist here in the material plane. Unless you return to Avernus, for good, this thing is going to blow. Sooner rather than later. But... But still, you, you can give me something that will let me touch again, right? Safely. Yes, but... That's all I need to know. Do it. Please. Yeah. Feel kind of bad for her, yeah. Three, three is like the worst option you could possibly pick. Yeah. I'm debating between one and two. I mean, I, I dare say she heard, but she just I'd, doesn't care. I'd 100% say one. Yeah. Well. All right. This shouldn't take long. Wait, we met Elminster. Gail, fucking give him a buzz. Mm. He had to help with this shit. Infernal well, he'll know someone who can. Huh? Infer infernal engineering, though, it may not be possible. You'll know someone who can. Same Those, as last you know, time. Gods. You'll mm. need to install it yourself. This should do the trick. There. So did it work? So a fire oh, one way to find everywhere. Out. I 
I knew you'd do that. <laughs> it's, ex it's literally the exact thing she said she wanted. Yeah, fair call. Thank you. I can't believe it. Thank you, Dallon. Thank you so much. It's the least I could do. Before you go, there's something I need to tell you. That oh, engine come on. of yours. Oh. It's contained for the moment. You it's just us. too hot to exist here in the material plane indefinitely. I know you know that. But the thing is, oh. there's a cure. Uh -huh. I wasn't making any headway with the mechanics, none at all. The environment here is just too cold to sustain metals like the ones inside you. You have to return to Avernus. For good. Or this thing is going to burn you up from the inside out. And sooner than you think. The minute I set foot back in Avernus, Zarya will force me back into service. I am not doing her bidding again. I'd rather die. I get that, but don't rule it out. The world just might be better with you in it. Even in Avernus. I won't stop trying to figure out a cure, but at this point, I think we all have to face the inevitable. It's just taking yeah, quite a while. Frozen. I was going to say happened. it's taking a while for this to show up. Yeah. Yeah. Here, oh, there we go. That's just um. One or three. Ooh. Three to me sounded a bit floaty, but. Yeah. I reckon I'm going one, because. Yeah. Cheers, bro. Apart from the doom and gloom, you've given me more than I could ever hope to repay. It's been my pleasure. Good luck. Both of you. Look after yourself, alright? Okay. Do you sell stuff, bro? He does. Oh, we should talk to us in there. There we go. This is the best day. The best day. I'm so happy. I don't want to depress her. For me too. Now I just need to find someone to cuddle up to tonight, and I'll be Whoop. the happiest woman on the Sword Coast. <laughs> Oh, I do love garlic. Oh. Do I point out the obvious or just. I'd say leave it till tomorrow at least. Yeah, fair cop. Anyone in mind? I'm Go not for it. sure. Depends who's got me in mind. Withers was giving me the old eye the other night. Then ah. again, maybe it was just an old eye. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll, I'll ask you about tomorrow. I'll probably head back to camp. Uh, this is one of those um, very mild spoiler things, but there's a thing for a star agent inside there. So, in where? Uh, inside the actual main building. Oh, that building over there. Yeah. So I'm thinking, uh, long rest since I need one anyway. Uh, swap Shadow Heart out for Carlac briefly. Or, um, take take Carlac out. I'll get Lazel back. Swap Shadow Heart for um, for a star and for the conversation then switch back again. Okay. Sure. Oh, new camp. Yeah. I like this one. There's a different one for sort of every environment you're in, which is quite nice. Yeah, no, I, I, I know. I just, I like this one. This one looks nice. Hmm. Starian actually wants to talk as well. Yeah, so we've got another piece of infernal iron here. I'm not sure what we can ever use it for, but we have it. I guess hey, we, it'll be it'll be useful, you know, if we ever actually need it. I anticipate it would. <laughs> I don't think there's enough there's a need for one of them, but 
You end up getting way more than you're ever going to need. Yeah. We've also got multiple of every kind of bag known to mankind. Why and how? Hmm. I, I'm not quite sure how that happens. I think they're breeding. Yeah, which is odd. It's not like we've been, you know, having temporary uh, party or anything. Hmm. Uh, recipes unlocked. Well, that's glorious. Hi, Starion, what do you want? You know, I feel a connection between us. Wait, what? Like we're two souls walking the same path. Um... You might be a little naive in the ways of the world, but I see promise in you. Ambition. Um, you just call me naive. I'm pretty sure that was a word. Okay, option one. I Boom. You have a big heart. You like doing what's right. So I was thinking, what would be the right thing to do when we get to Moonrise Towers? When we come face to face with whoever is controlling the parasites in our heads. Um, well, you're speaking to the wrong person for whatever you're planning, but... <laughs> oh, try to think outside the box just a little. I am. I am going to smite the shit out of that box. And think how many others have the mind players infected. <coughs> Hundreds. <coughs> oh. Thousands. I know where you're going with this, you dick. And they're not just goblin trash. There are powerful people in the worm's thrall. Whoever's waiting for us at Moonrise Towers controls it all. But if we can take that control, I knew you were going to say that. You imagine the power we bring. I mean, he does no, have vampire, a point. I have a stake. He does. He does have a point. It would be a decent amount of power to be wielding. Option three is, you know, pretty fucking obvious. But option one is just. Uh, mm, Three, just pointing it back, pointing it out to him. just the thing. If we control the parasites, then we can order them not to change us. All um, the power with none of the tentacles. I don't think he quite what understands how this works. There's an opportunity mm. here. If we can control the tadpoles, we can keep ourselves safe and liberate the world from this evil. You know, you'd get, you'd get approval for number three. No. But you definitely would. Just... No. So much for thinking you had ambition. Ambition in the world. I will ambitionlessly slug my greatsword up your rectum. Yet. <laughs> I see the light all the time, unlike you, vampire boy. Alright, playing as him in the map main paint playthrough is going to be hilarious as hell. Hmm. Uh, where are you? You're down there. No, you're not. Uh, Karlak. So I've got to leave Karlak here and grab the Starion, don't I? Soldier. Uh, I'd recommend you grab the, um... No, you leave Shadowheart and grab a Starion so I can get my Zell back. There is... I mean, yeah, pretty, pretty. pretty we lovely. have to get Karlak out of the party as well, so. Oh, derp. <laughs> I was like, oh, so I don't need to talk to Karlak then. I'm an idiot. What's on your mind? Oh, come on. You don't mean that. Yes, we do. Kind of was a siren. Oh, fine. I'll be here eating dirt or whatever. That was uh, escalation. You just play with Clive. Oh, there she is. Oh, she's got a nice one with a view. I know why she chose this. Excellent. Poor Karlak. Oh. She can finally seek out the touch of another, only to be told she might not have much time left. Mm. If you're sure. Fine. I'll be here whenever you rediscover your taste in ah. company. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Mm. I'll grab lights up. If death is soon to take Karlak, she should make every moment as rich as the last. Fight viciously, roar loudly, step boldly. She must make herself known. Uh. 
Okay. Oh, where is he? A starion over there. So, the untouchable Karlak is untouchable no more. Yep, go touch her. Go I have fun. Shake your hand, but you can still snap me in two. So, uh, <coughs> perhaps not. Oh boy. Um, yep. Darling, I thought you'd never ask. We need to no. fight people with him shortly, or no? That's interesting. The number of bed rolls around the fire does actually change with the number of people in the party. I mean, it should, but I didn't notice that. Yeah, because I was when I was where I'm standing right now. There was no bed roll there a second ago. Ah, oh. tripper. Uh, actually, do you want to talk to anybody else before we went to bed? Uh, no, not that I can see. Oh, oh that was good. We're basically having a full pig. On the twisted Scalaritas and his honeyed words of violence. Huh? You called for me, my lady? Oh, that fucker again. <laughs> I, I like option four. Just shriek. Option three is hilarious. I am trying not to give in to dark urgy things, but... Uh, well, let's go in option one, then. Mm -hmm. I don't need to. <laughs> they are all the same. There is but one thing on your mind, and it won't go away until your thirsty urge is sated. I come here, for I wish to bring you another powerful tithe. But I cannot grant you this prize quite yet. You must do something divinely unspeakable first. Um. <laughs> um. I mean, I, I... I want to do three or four, but I'm not going to. That's me resisting my own dark urges. Um. You will receive a royal prize for killing this pretty girl. Oh, you can fuck off. I will kill you. Isabel, the cleric with the sweetest face of the moon. No, she no. is too precious to live. No, if you do, you're going to get a paladin on your face. Interesting. It's not going to end well for you. Why? The greatest crime of them all. <laughs> Nothing at all. If I, if I do kill her, can I get her outfit? Because that is pretty cool. No. It is pretty cool, though, to be fair. Oh, Master. Consider the uh, tiny mishap of the you had the last time we met. Hmm? Your unconscious clever mind hungers for extreme violence. Who knows who you might kill next if you do not satisfy your urge. I killed dozens of people. Be true to yourself, my lady. Interesting. Got a demon saying you want to do X, Y, Z. Hmm. Uh, and considering I know who that is, she um, she's not a person we're killing. That's for damn sure. No, it's more. Whatever the dark ages has a demon talking to them. Hmm. Yeah, I was just, just looking there to see if I can actually get in the fucking... Hmm. That way. Every time you see a waterfall, look behind it, just in case. I mean, oh, yep. there's that too, but it's more, can I get to the water? Hmm. I mean, the yeah, other thing, of course, is... Carlite Car could probably have just jumped in. Would have created a nice sauna. Hmm. 
Ah, here. To the water down here. Ah, oh, right, doing the um, cleaning off thing. Yeah, no, I'm just mildly curious as to why have I got like red boots? Ah, oh, that's just a uh, visual indication that you've got a um, debuff to speed. Oh, Diffi wet. Yeah, difficult terrain, right. deep water. Movement speed is halved. Uh, alrighty, um, mildly distracted. Let's go back. Alrighty, so where was the thing we needed? Northern thing or? Uh, in the building to the west. Hang on. Where is Lazel's helmet showing? Reaction. Quickly then. At least things have stayed in. Starion looks awesome. Hmm. Anything? A faded advertisement. Its message still faintly legible. Fresh veg and fancy fruit. Buy two, get one free. Premium trinkets and doodads. Yes, ma'am. Tempted to see what the premium trinkets and doodads are. Well, they're awesome. Yeah. Who's yeah. flying? I think that's a kid we saved from the um the fucking harpies. Oh, uh, these two. Yeah. There's so much stuff. What's in the loose plank? Have you opened it yet? No, no. Uh, a showburst ring. Deal cold damage. You also deal ice damage and a scribbled note. Scribbled note reads much. I mean, I'd probably take the ring. Wait, shrines to the Moon Maiden in Catherick Thorn. Yeah, now I've got the ring. Um, when the wearer deals cold damage, they also create a 4.5 meter circle of ice around the targets. There you go. Hmm. It's actually better than the jumping spell. I don't really use the jumping spell. I can just keep it on me. I'll talk to you in a minute, trinkets and doodads person. Fist Greta. Oh, flaming fist. Right, I should probably look. Or I'm not taking anything out of this room. Because I want to live. But the boss lady is somebody we already know, so... We probably got pulled. Was that the counselor? Yep. Hey, holy shit, it is too. Trippy. What's she been up to? He still won't speak. Just keeps going with the bloody song. Nothing of use on his person. His original writ of duty. Signed by Elton himself. Fella must be one of the very first flaming fist. He must know something. Let's not give up on him yet. We believe the cultists have taken Duke Ravenguard to Moonrise Towers. I don't suppose you've found a way in. Not yet. I trust you will do everything you can to free the Duke. But in case you don't find a way, I'll be heading to Baldur's Gate to seek reinforcements. Yeah. The council sent a carrier pigeon with news that the city has been dealing with absolutist attacks. The Steel Watch is holding strong. I'll request that Lord Gortash send some of them to aid in the fight against Moonrise. The curse won't harm them. You know the name Gortash, a councillor with considerable influence on Baldurian industry and politics. But he is no lord. Well, let's play that game. Lord Gortash is the man responsible for the creation of the Steel Watch. It's no wonder he earned the title. 
The Steel Watch are the future of warfare. Gondian automatons that can be sent into battle. Oh no. Except those of our enemies. Nothing could go wrong. Uh, Lord that's going to win so badly. Prototypes before Raven Guard and I left for Elteral, but even they were formidable. With the Steel Watch at our backs, we can storm the tower whatever Ketherick throws at us. I'm sure of it. I'll do my best, but there's every chance I'll fall to the curse of all the cult before I reach the city. Don't count on me and assume no aid is coming. Work with Jahira. That harper's mind is as sharp as her blade. Follow her guidance. Farewell. Mm. We'll meet again, God's willing. Just going. Is it at least tell me where you got your dress?